Morning everyone, welcome to day 35 of daily uploads. You're watching Teeth and Turbos and we are at the Freedom Factory for cars and coffee this morning. Cars starting to trickle in. Looks like we got about 50 to 60 cars out here on the track already. I brought the Hellcat today, obviously, because I've been posting a ton with it. So I'm gonna kind of give you guys a tour about what's here, who's here, and uh, so that y'all can join in on the fun. If you haven't been to a Freedom Factory event, April 5th, we're gonna have our literally our biggest event we've ever had at Cletus and Cars and then also the Freedom 500. So tickets are available online right now and I'm guaranteeing that this is gonna be a sold out event. So get them while they last. All right, so obviously I've been posting a crap ton about this car. Y'all have seen it lifted with the Whiffle. This is my buddy Wiley's Aston DBS. Pretty sick, clean car. I'm just gonna walk around and give you guys a long tour of what's here for today's video so that uh, you can see what shows up to the Freedom Factory events. Here's the Cleese and McFarland driving experience cars ready to rip for the next crowd that comes through here. If you haven't seen online, you can race one of these cars around the track yourself. We have Zach Walker's lifted car that he won in Lamolitz last year. Looks like we have some kind of autocross looking car here. Nice, nice. It's looking rigged, dude. Warming up. Warming up, is that what you said? Yeah. Got a fire. Got a fire. Oh, I see what you're doing. Got the Wayland Mobile. Decked out with lights. Looking good. Looking real good. That thing's pretty sweet, too. Well, I just got talking with the Wheeling guy. Awesome products. If you haven't seen their stuff, they did all the lighting on Cleed's truck and the Defender that's on the track. Let's start out and showing you guys kind of what's here. We got this Evo. Kind of tuned up, some bolt-ons here. Got a little scat pack action. Jump points here. Oh, dang, dude, Mach 1. The supercharger on it, I like the looks good. Oh, well, that's swap. Sick. What's up with this gasser looking Corvette here? Oh, dang. Pretty cool. Coyote. G8. Thing. Oh, here's Crispy's <clears throat> LS Swap Infinity. This thing's super clean. Looks good, brother. Looking good. Keep it up. Like sitting on the couch. GT4. Ooh, Evo STO. They're pretty nasty. Hey, okay. All right, Papa and I are out here at the Cars and Coffee at the Freedom Factory, and you think that you found your favorite car here, is that right? Yes, sir. If you could pick one car, which one, what's it gonna be? I like this Corvette, right? You here. like the Corvette? Yes. The kind of gasser look, right? Exactly. Carburetor sticking out of the hood. Right, right. They're pretty cool. Look at that, even like ceramic coated uh, headers on this thing. It's a pretty clean car. It is. The body work, it looks like it's in great shape. I mean, wouldn't this thing be fun to drive to church? It sure would. Yeah, Monica, <laughs> get ready. <laughs> we wouldn't be late, that's for sure. No, you wouldn't be late to church. <laughs> Okay guys, while I'm here at the Freedom Factory, I kind of want to go over some awesome events they have going up because this is one of those places that you can bring your family and friends. I mean, they've got clean bathrooms, merch for sale. They've got great food. It's an awesome experience to bring your kids, your cousin, your wife, anybody. So I'm going to talk to you guys about some events that are coming out that we're pretty excited about. So obviously the biggest one coming up, which is probably going to be our biggest event we've ever had is the Freedom 500 and Cletus and Cars April 4th and April 5th. There's going to be an epic prize for that race. There's going to be a lot of YouTubers and car influencers racing that weekend. Awesome burnout show. It's going to be 
such a sick time. So if you haven't already, the tickets are definitely going to sell out for that event. Like I said, it's probably going to be our biggest event that's ever occurred at the Freedom Factory. If you want to bring your car and drive it down onto the burnout pad and the track, the next Cars and Coffee event is on March 16th. There's other tour destructions. The Winter Series is going to be on March 1st and 2nd. That's going to be with those double stack cars they've got. They're going to have Rangers, Crown Vicks. That's going to be a really sick one. And then, uh, you know, another tour destruction event. I mean, if you get on the Freedom Factory's website, there is tons of events coming up. So if you live in the area, if you live in Ireland, I mean, people fly in from all over the world for these events. It's so fun. So fun. Um, all right, guys, if you guys didn't know, I'm doing 75 hard right now. It's two workouts a day, 45 minutes each. One of them has to be outside. You have to drink a gallon of water a day, take a picture. And I've also been doing daily YouTube videos. I think we're on day 34 or 35 straight of YouTube videos. It's been able to get me to that 100,000 subscriber mark. And I really, I really gotta say that it is probably one of the hardest things I've ever done in my life. And I've really pushed myself. My business is taking a toll. My personal life is taking a toll. And so I've got a video coming out tomorrow about how I think that if you're watching this video, you should start making content yourself too, because there's a time in my life about three years ago after Garrett bought the track and then watching all these guys have fun where I said to myself, either I can watch from the sidelines or I can jump in and have fun with the boys. So if you are in that position, if you're sitting on your couch, scrolling on Instagram, watching YouTube videos, I encourage you to pick up your phone and start recording. We record all of our stuff on iPhones. You can use a GoPro. I mean, you can use whatever camera you want. Just post it. If you're worried about people making fun of you, guess what? It's gonna happen. People are gonna be mean to you on the internet. You gotta learn to find humor in it. So that's what I've done. And uh, yeah, guys, this episode is just kind of me chatting about future events, the event that we're at, some cool cars that are here and have showed up. I really appreciate you guys watching today. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe, like, leave me a comment, and we'll see you tomorrow. Have you ever found yourself in a situation where you've been wrenching on your car, need a 10 millimeter wrench? plowing a bag of flaming hot Cheetos and drinking a Dr. Pepper and realize, dang it, I really need to brush my teeth. Well, now's your chance. I'm talking Dr. Parker's 10 millimeter tool brush, a toothbrush on one end, a 10 millimeter wrench on the other. This sucker, CNC billet aluminum, baby. Lifetime warranty. Get them now at CletusMcFarland.com.